did before they can see. I know, I know, I know, I know. Smart. I was a little too late. Like five minutes. No, so. like 40, 40 milliseconds. Minutes. You like to get in here? Minutes. It needs to be further. I don't want to push myself. How about that? How about that? No! Jesus. Jesus. I think my contact's still in my eye somewhere. Really? Yeah, man. It's fucking me up, man. Seriously? <laughs> my dog just farted. Told him just how to fart it. Gross. It was like thing changed. It, it was like, like out and then out. Ew. Told him that was a good fart, bro. <laughs> Ew, no, what? Arash, you can't support the fart. No. Is it on the filter? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey! Hey! There you go. There you go, guys. Dog control. That's how that's how I handle my bitches too. No. Right? Is that how I handled you, Jessica? No. Right? Pretty much, right? Be honest though. Crazy, the garbage. I'm like, Gosh, stop that. What happened? Tell him what happened. Tell him what happened. You keep on burping in my mouth. <laughs> Ew. I just burped right into her face. <laughs> Much better, man. I just burped right into her face. Jessica, did you smell the burp? No, because no, I breathed it in. Thank you, Jessica. You're such, no, you're such a... I did it so no one else would have to. You're fucking great. Yeah. Savage as fuck. Nick say. Nick say. Is that how no. I should handle my German Shepherd? No, man. You gotta, It's more than just a yell. It's the energy. Jesus. Because the garbage is going to be all over the floor. Okay. No. This is cool. He's not in your control yet. Grab his leash. Put a leash on him and start putting him in a controlled position, right? He's not, you don't have his attention. You need his attention to control him. Why the glasses, dude? Because my fucking contact lens flew in my eye upstairs. Tell him the truth. He's getting older. Old age comes with glasses. That's true. Hey, Electra, Echo from the past here. I wanted to let you know. We love your daily videos. I had to be in a tumor removal. Oh, Whoa. Girl and I've been healing. I just listened to you like a recharging my brain. So you're so fucking empowering. Truly, my Please keep doing what you're doing. Good. What's this bitch's name? She was cool. I remember yeah, her. She was cool. Right on. Good girl. Hey guys, there's Sarah Maldonado with a heart. Hi. Let's go say hi to Sarah. David Vidras, speak a little on the power of subconscious mind. Okay, that may happen. I'll tell you girls something. I didn't really feel good looking tonight, but I had a lot of great game going on. Great. Awesome. Didn't like my beard. Didn't like what was happening. It actually has a huge ass... Fuck Kiki on her neck. Yeah, that's what it is. Hey. It's actually yeah, a flower. Yeah, it's so big that it bulges out of her freaking barrel. I, I told you what to do. Hannah, get her his fucking attention. I don't want to yell, and he's on, like, he's, like, licking the floor. Well, get his attention. Do what you have to do to get his attention. Shut up. Terrible, Hannah. Be his leader, not his bitch. You guys entertain everybody. Okay. Sup, <laughs> bitches. Basically. Hey, hey Kathy. Really? Hello, honey. How you do today? You look so good. It looks like I'm having a strong. Kathy and daughter work. was in yoga today. And my nose. You, you know what? You need Watch. something on his neck sharper. Either that or hire a regular collar. <laughs> 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 Go slow, in the vlog when I For I entertainment hair. purposes, I will be slow, giving a rush some water. <laughs> there you go. I will be stroking his beard. <sighs> nice. <laughs> These hoes thirsty, so we keep water on the side. Keep the leash with you. This is over there. Control him with the leash. Heel. <laughs> Whoa. Enemy's blood. The water of the sit. Hand. Down. Good. Sit. Fountain of you. Good. Heal. Elixir. Of you have to get him out of things like this for now. Eternity. Okay. Good boy. Heal. Sit. Liquid beauty. Good. Shh. <laughs> Shh. <laughs> Shh. Come on. Shh. Fountain Go of. On. You. Watch out. Let's do this again. Uh, forever existence. Let's do this. Sphinx, move your big ass. Thank you. 
All right. Hi, Rosh. You still practicing the mystery method? Always. Do you still talk to Eric time to time? Haven't in a while. No. Do your girls know about his, this period of your life? No. The whole world knows, but my girls don't. Of course they do. What are your thoughts on feng shui? I don't know. I never I'm really good Rosh. at it. You know, it's really upsetting. Are you going to break up? Are you going to break up right now? Right. I actually have multiple girlfriends. What? No. Yeah. Wait, what? Wow, that's Excuse Electra. Me? That's Excuse Jessica. Me? That's Hannah. This is not your sister? No, these are my girlfriends. <laughs> Hannah, get out of the camera. That was your that's cousin. Okay, everybody slow down. Let's do this. Hannah, me, my girlfriend, Electra. No. <laughs> Electra, no. me, Jessica. No. Jessica, I, me, Hannah. That is actually not happening right well, now. Well, not. And I was just out right now getting bitches. Are you fucking kidding me? I swear to God. Are you reading I'm coming, a I'm coming what true. What do you mean? Wait, you, I, you used game? Oh, mm-hmm. my God. I was not in the library right now. Oh, my God. It's That's okay. Up. It's okay. No, yeah. I, I introduced you. Okay. To Hold on. <laughs> I actually have three more girlfriends. No. What? They're not here. Yep. They're not here, but you, I, you know them. I think. They're not my just my friends. Life is over. I'm about no. to have a BF. <laughs> you pop it. You pop it. Relax. You don't pull it. I gotta get out of here. I'm about to have. A How about BF. you hang in here to see what happens? It's gonna take a while for me to get used to a rush of glasses. Please have some patience with me. Me too, bro. Don't get used to it. This is just Move. temporary. I like you. I like him too. The girls like it for some fucking reason. I think you it calms look me down. Yeah, what? you got a bad angle. When I was out, got a lot of compliments. The moment I put it on, I was everybody softened. No, you it. look great. When you that had, was did your cool. video, I saw them and then I was like, hey. Yeah, totally. Electra, love your fitness videos. You guys are amazing. There you go. Laugh Alejandro. Good. When he relaxes, do you let go of the leash? You get it? Yeah, he's not relaxed. He looks fine right now. Okay. Good evening, my brilliant, handsome king. Chelsea, that's Who my other girlfriend. Her? That's my girlfriend. Who that's my girlfriend. Her? That's my girlfriend. That is not actually she what wants, is Chelsea? She wants to oh, sit on my dick. Oh, not on She wants to sit on my dick. Oh, oh my, my god. I'm coming true now. Oh. Chelsea's Whoa. like, what the fuck just happened? Idea. Whoa. <laughs> She's Kay. like, you guys remember me? <laughs> what do you think women admire me about, about me the most? My honesty, honesty. and my uh, intelligence. Mm. Relax it. Mm. Relax it. There's no... Hey. I would take the intelligence. <laughs> Sarah laughs. Mm. You look like a professor. I am. You guys are looking sharp. They are. I look like a fucking bum. I admit it. I'm good with it. Shh. Hey. Shh. Good boy. Let go of the leash when he does that. Don't grip it. You can loosen it. If he fucks around, snap it. Hello, gorgeous lecture. Hannah hello. and Jess. No, hello, hello. Hello, honey. How are you? Hi. Hi. <laughs> well, look at this right Hipster or Rosh? What? This is funky. Mm, I don't know how I feel about that flower. Yeah. Nice. It was cool with my, my yeah, dress. Yeah, it's not cool right now. Wearing. Take it off. Oh, <laughs> my. Yeah, it's not right now. Not right yeah. now. It was back yeah. then. We're back. What's the topic today? I haven't decided yet. To be honest with you, Hannah was driving me because I was so drunk. They picked me up. Hannah, what was I talking about in the car? You were asleep. Tell them, what? You were asleep. I was knocked the fuck out until we got to the house. So it took me about 10 minutes to be here. Ha, huh? I love to see you guys are back. Devlin, Devlin. what's up? Devlin. Hello, you, honey. You're a peasant fag lord. You so gay. Must be, if you say it. Uh, oh my God. That is so everything you so say, person, people huh? listen to. Do you believe in building a chick from no. nothing? Don't pull. Relax your arm. Or would you rather have one that's already there? There's no one that's already there, my brother. Mm-mm. Don't pull. I mean... Uh, it's like build a bear. It's build a chick. <laughs> We're supposed to do that. I raped your mother. There's Adrian. There's Adriana, a very angry human being. What? He's very... becoming weird. My no, they're not going to fight. Okay, they're not going to fight. I'll fuck him up. My girl flatmate also watching is interested. Girls are favorite brand, please share. What? Huh? My girl flatmate also watching is interested. What are the girls' favorite makeup and brand? Please share. It's called what? Dollface by IMC Academy. Hey, just lets you know you're doing great thing. I don't care. Missed your call. Missed you all. Hey, Nelly. I'm going to kill your bitches. Yeah, I'm, I believe you. <laughs> I have an easy time creating attraction. It seems like the girls come to what's best method method to get them all fall in love you need to study what i do you're a loser you're yeah. good you sound you sound like a winner right now you totally sound like a winner coming on my channel acting like an idiot that's inappropriate you're what? coming on his channel that's right there's 35 people online 10 people press like no nope. if your family and your fans and friends press like if you're a hater no need to we're good stop let me get this I 
cunt. <laughs> the last person, yeah. Jess. Move, move <laughs> those shoes, okay? Bro, you gave me a badass <laughs> idea the other day. Right on. I can imagine TMZ following you around. Of course, no one gives a fuck about you. You do. Best you're still on. I love you, nigga. You're a god. You better believe it. What's the next product about? Forbidden Gate, man. Check it out. Would you ever turn your beard into a birdcage? Sure. Real nigga shit. You got it. What's the most amount of women you can handle at one time? I don't know yet. Top Dog Raj, what's good? Fuck Adriana, Internet Thug. Hi Raj, what's up Stan? What's the number one reason why people just don't succeed? I don't know. Look at that blonde whore next to Raj. Wow, you're doing good. Fuck that whore. I do, all the time. <laughs> Gotta put this on some game. What's up? Yeah, what's Forbidden Gate about? First lecture done. Girls, how was it? Power. Oh my gosh, so... We just did, last lecture was last night. Oh, two nights ago I did it. Two nights. Yeah. It was unreal. I can't tell you what it's about. Most exotic place you've ever been and why? United States. It's fucking exotic as shit. You guys are just used to it. Try coming from another country. You'll see how exotic this place is. Fuck me and my ginger anus daddy. <laughs> Call you guys in the, at the gym. Right on. I'm your gay lord. Get that dumb hoe adrenaline off. No, let him play because he, I get paid every time he comments. USA. What's up, USA? You look cool as fuck eating cereal too. <laughs> if I pay for a call, will you help me? Seminars, how to advertise yourself. Real talk, man. Yeah, I don't want to do Skype, but it's a thousand bucks for an hour. Uh, Raj, what happened to Zapar? What happened to him? The haters don't realize that their remarks are compliments. Of course they are. Hey! He has to go to the bathroom for sure. Do you want to take him? Yeah. No, you can't. You can put him in the cage or you can take him in the bathroom. What do you want to do? So we're going to him all three. What are you talking about? The blonde whore has daddy issues. That's why she's with you. You're probably one of the people in her past. I was and going too bad. to yeah. daddy issue whore look today. Yeah, yeah. You did it. It Nailed looks like it. you accomplished it. $1,000 an hour. Holy shit, man. I'm going to raise the price, bro. I don't want doing it. Do I believe in the reptilian... Do, I, do you believe in the reptilian race? I believe in all races, dog. Most of all, I believe in the human race. Here we is. Mm -hmm. Making shit happen. I believe the children are I can't believe I'm actually lecturing right now, dude. Wow. You're I doing it. zero to a hundred. It's <laughs> ridiculous. You know how tired I was. Yeah. Zero to a hundred. It's ridiculous what I can do. Man, I just get in the zone. I mean, I feel very cold right now and it's bothering me. Cold? It's just not fair for him. Okay, take him out. Go. Take him out. Go I ahead. Mean, he just walk him right here. here. It's okay. Better my mind because I'm transit in an hour. Just to keep Jessica happy because Jessica has to be happy all the time, right, Jessica? <laughs> no, it's just like what? I, he, it's just not fair for him. It's really not. <laughs> it bothers me. I okay. totally would. I know you would, but I'm not gonna let you. So she has to do it. I do you mean, believe? I that? walked him right before. Yeah. Did he poo? Yeah, he pooed anything. Try, try five ten minutes. Sorry. Drunk on a Wednesday, boss shit. Yep. No. Move. Correct. No, Jessica, you can't drink one. I have a soft spot for dogs. Move, cool. Biden. No. No. I have a soft spot for humans. Mm -hmm. so it keeps me going. Your elbow look closer, but it's totally not, you know? But I'm looking in here. <laughs> who's that new whore on the Arash's right side? Well, you've been watching, so you're a fan? Because you're like, who's that new whore? You know everybody? You know everybody? You're Chris Brown. Yeah, okay. Arash, would you train dogs for money? Maybe. How much? That's why they're with you. <laughs> How, so pathetic. Yeah. So pathetic. Oh, he has to correct himself. You, just to make sure you know. How long do your girls take to prepare for the day? How do you deal with it? They take different times. I think it actually has to take very little time. Just takes like two hours. Who? <laughs> Should I get a GF tested before I sex? Up to you. Look good with them glasses. Thank you, Arash. I'm glad I found your teachings. You're welcome. There's a phone number right there. New jewels. No. Hey, bro, miss most of the lecture tonight. We'll catch up. I just I haven't even started. I'm drinking water. It came from in field, man. I've been drunk. Can it's we block time. Adriana Garcia? The insults are too boring and cliche. Now let him go for a while. This is an idiot. And I've been told him itches his own face. Oh, gosh, I'm getting vast amounts of pussy. Thanks, man. Hey. You're welcome. Send me some money for that, dude. Mm -hmm. Any man getting any pussy should send money. Oh, gosh, why are the price so high for a diamond mine? It's not. It's $97 a month, dude. Do you believe that we live in a hologram? Yes. Size matter. How do you give it to them deeper level if you know what I mean? Size does matter. Does matter. If you don't have good size dick, then do everything else before what? you fuck her. <laughs> this is so inappropriate. Why? I teach about sex. That's why. Yeah, yeah. but every time still. I think of this, I'm like. Who's that whore all the way to Rosh's left? <laughs> What's the key to instant creative inspiration? No idea. We need more than one hater. 
That dude's boring. Hey, John's boring. Hmm? Gotcha, bro. Much love. Hey, John, I'm going to knock you out with my bulging disc. Get <laughs> <laughs> yeah, after him. Yeah, it's inappropriate. I like pit bulls wow. as well. It would be cool if you could make a product about training animals. Check out Primal Canine. That's my brother. Glad I made it then. Good. Arash lowered his prices because no one is buying his shit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> He's still on talking. Can't see the idiot. I'm a cheap fag. $100 a month. This is too much. Any suggestions? Oh, Make money. Nice. Hello, Arash. What's cooking tonight? What's up, Ralph? How do I manifest my thoughts faster? Diamond mind. Floyd O'Connor, Floyd for this fight. What? Can I move my car? Do what you gotta do. Yeah. I can print to be a hitter if you need me to fill in. Nah, it's good. It used to be 90. You're a loser. You've been following me for a while, huh? All right, your demonic teachings are corrupt, and I don't fuck care. It's good info. Okay. All right, you wear Jordans? Yeah. I'm gonna rape your mother's anus. She'll enjoy it. What percent of power do we get on Diamond Mind when we get here? I don't know what you're talking about. Just get on Diamond Mind. Stop asking questions about it. You know what I mean? If you want to do it, do it. If you don't, don't. It's all right. A lot of people are doing it. Does nature have the answers? No. No. You have the answers. Nature is already there. I'm going to rape your father's anus. Cool. <laughs> but you he'll rape you first before you could do it. <laughs> you train boxing in game. I'm walking in this week. Yeah. Come on in, bro. Come on in. We'll do some boxing. What's your investment portfolio look like? Any insights? It's not cool. Whatever. Which one of your girls rides you the best? All of them. Differently. Tyson or Ali, best heavyweight. Mm, both different. This is your guy is going to place his life, right? Sup, what's up? 42 people online, 27 likes. If you've got to press like, press like, please. Is there a free sample material I can check out on Diamond Man Program? No, man. You don't deserve it if you're looking for that shit. In your opinion, do girls find your mind or your body more attractive? My mind. How much do you charge per month to teach men panjo? 47. Do all three sleep together? It must be a big deal. No, no, no. I have six girlfriends and we don't all sleep together. That's weird. Arash is gay. Yeah, I look gay. Would you open an IMC in another location? Maybe. Maybe. Depending on who wants to open it with me. I'm done with Jameson. What? No, he does that when he when speaks. He wants some oh, dick. That's he wants some pussy. Dirty. He wants that's pussy. That's sick, bro. That's not okay, Totem. He like does something At least he controls himself. Diamond Mind is a scam. Yeah. You would know, right? I'm trying to get a girl at work. Any advice? Yeah, Diamond Mind. You always contradict yourself. Yeah, you watching me for that long? What's the biggest lesson you've learned from Sandra Batata? Man, fear no one for sure. That man will go after everybody. Uh, which would you recommend? Uh, Diamond Mind. Do you torrent your videos? Is legal stuff? I don't know what you Sarah, Arash, your videos are amazing. This just make my day. Thank you. Sarah who? Maldonado. Do you guys know her? Sarah, message me on Instagram. Based Arise on apart. On Arise apart, I am C. I'm going to kill those two whores. Try it. <laughs> try it. Tonight? Oh, try it. I dare you. How much per month to learn Panjo? 49 a month, bro. Or 47. What is Diamond Mind? My, my daily coaching program online. Go to ariseapart.com. Out of water. It turns shit minds to diamonds. You still do one on one? I do a lot of one on ones, but. You're going to have to qualify. <laughs> Arash, I'm applying your teaching. Is it true people can see and feel a change about you? Of course. Arash, I'll intern you for free if I can just go to clubs with you. No, I don't need that. Hello, Jess. I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you in the next challenge and you will eat that donut, says Nancy. Nancy, I just don't lose, girl. How much do you charge for your BJ? 47 or 49 a month, I think, for all unlimited martial arts. Look at the whore and the black hair. Fuck you, retard. You're such an idiot. I'm your FB on Electra. I'm on your FB on Electra's program, Sarah. Message oh, me. Oh, Sarah. No, she messaged you. I haven't talked to her. That's freaking. Yeah, Arash you did talk to Zapar her. IMC. Message me again. Or I'll pay for intern. Nice live stream. Thanks, man. 47 per month in person. How many classes per week? Seven days a week, bro. Do as much as you can. All day. What the hell is Panjo? My fighting system I created. Your girls are pretty, bro. Congrats. Thanks. Congrats to them. When you talk about an elect sharing a burrito. You had nothing. It's like a movie scene, bro. It's true. You mean Electra? Yeah. Brazil. What's up, Brazil? No, What's up, Brazil? My heart piece every time. Fuck you, Arash. Yeah, try it. I would challenge. What? I would challenge you to a medieval duel. Okay, Brazil. You don't want any more disciples. Why? No time. Not no one qualified. Adriana having a field day with the shit talking. <laughs> this is an idiot. Brazil, Brazil. I'm a steal. Okay. <laughs> What's the best exercise to do? At home for be for jujitsu. I don't have one of those. Damn, that's dirt cheap. Out here in San Diego, it's one forty a month. Yep. 
And sell for two. Yeah, you're an idiot. Oh, you Persian, right? Yep. Is self deprecating humor unhealthy? <laughs> not if you know what you're doing. Mm-hmm. Opinion on Tupac, one of the greatest I that ever lived. Love you, love you too. What's up, my honeys? Okay, Brazil. Who is this? Arash motherfucking D Bazaar. Look it up. Which one of your programs have you worked on the hardest on? There isn't such thing. I work hard on all of them. Uh, why does he have baddies? You're a fool, man. Test me and I'll prove to you that I'm qualified. You're not qualified because you haven't paid for shit. How are you going to be qualified with no money? When is Hannah going to put your audiobooks on Audible? Maybe never. I don't know. We got the shit we got to do. Yeah, actually, can you give me some more water? Yeah. Yeah. Hello from Turkmenistan. What's up? Have you ever studied any pimps? Yeah, one of my good friends is a pimp. Shout out to Kevin Gentry. I want to be... Oh, you're an idiot. I'm an idiot. Sure. What do I say to family members who fuck my life because I'm an artist, refuse to sell cars? Let's see. What's up, Arash? What's up, greedy money? Much love. What's the biggest project on your plate these days? I'm not sure. Me. <laughs> Jessica. Hello, Arash. Sir. What's up, Ravi? Doing good, Ravi. Keep going, brother. Finish all the videos. I got more for you. I want to fuck that blonde bitch. Okay. Heavy metal or rap? Neither. Both are good. Give me the artist, not the, not the brand. I heard you voted for Hillary. What do you guys think about that? You're wrong. I voted for Trump. <sighs> Let's go. Ooh la 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 is the way that we walk when we do Wait, our Wait, no, thing. before you go, go. No, Jessica. No? Okay, no, no, no. No? Do you fuck with Kanye heavy? Yeah, I like Kanye West. When we reach the top of the mountain, Raj, there's no such thing. Do you regret voting for Trump? No. Be the best and fuck dusty sluts. Okay. What would I regret? Been studying like a madman, brother. Good, Ravi. Sarah, message me. Raj Zapar IMC. Let's go on Instagram. Hurry up. I haven't got it yet. Lauren Hill, sick reference, Raj. Yep. I've been fired from speaking. You've been, Jessica's fired from speaking. You like goosebumps. What's that? No. Yeah. I would literally work for you for free. Oh, come on, man. But you like that. We watch that all the time. Uh, you don't need to make millions. You need to make 97 a month to get on Diamond Mind. If you can't do that, you can't work for me. You can't use me to become successful when without me you ain't shit. You get, you get what you're doing? You're telling me, look, I ain't shit. Make me into somebody. I'll work for you for free. What do I get? Someone working for me for free? Why do I need you? What the fuck are you going to bring to my life when you haven't brought shit to your own life? Think about it. Common sense, man. Or right, do you have any new products to teach modern techniques and not inner game? What do you recommend? I recommend Diamond Mind. All right, thanks so much for everything. You were there for me when my dad passed. You're welcome. Talk about how to touch a lady's face romantically. Diamond Mind. What's the best compilation of videos you have for pickup? Diamond Mind. Okay. Sup fam, show love. What's up? Opinion on what's going on with the alt-right process. I don't watch the news. I don't know what you're talking about. I get them goosebumps every time I come around. Right on. Awash, what can you say about giving your trust to people? Or if you're going to, how would you know it's the right decision? I trust people. I don't give a fuck what people say. I trust people. How's that? How about that? Is it true you can tell you'd be really good at through inspires you? Not sure. What is your relationship with David Coker? I respect that guy like you. You're both great teachers. He's one of my friends and students, period. In what way will Diamond Mind improve my life? Don't worry about it. You don't need it. You got it already worked out. We'll start soon. I'm waiting for Hannah. She's walking up. Give it a few minutes. My mouth is super dry. If the whole world was the same, what was one sentence that would be most important to tell them? You need to help each other. I love you. Love you too. No. Is the brunette Asia? No. That's a con- con- continent. I don't know what that no. means. Is it fair for you, Rosh, bounce back from Pan faster than most? I bounce back very fast. All right, if I get it, man, money first, talk later. No. I'll be meet you in person, even though you don't give a shit. I do give a shit. I love you, Doty Maris says. I do give a shit. I do give a shit, actually. Nice. I give a lot of shits, actually. Kiss. Have you ridden a horse? No. <laughs> I have not. 
That's inappropriate. <laughs> Have you lived in SJ all your life? No. Nope. Nope. You trimmed your beard? No. Nope. What's more important, IQ or EQ? Don't know what EQ is, but IQ is great. Yeah. Yolanka, the cat face. Mm-hmm. Portuguese. I'm burping, Jessica. How's that? You've been fired from talking? Good. Anyone paid you to smash their girl? They offered. I said no. Something nags it. Give a shit. There you go. Do you like, do you like white mm-hmm. supremacists? That's weird. Hannah's back. Come on in, Hannah. Brazil. Do you enjoy painting? No. Hey, painting. Mm-hmm. EQ, emotional quote. I don't know what that means. Eye contact or keynote? Both. <laughs> We're not going to be able to purchase some IMC Diamond Mine wear. Not sure. Hello, what's up? Are you going to buy RV and travel with the honeys? No. Are we talking pickup tonight? No. I don't know what we're talking yet, actually. Hey. Midas. Mm-hmm. No. No, you're fired from talking. You want to be rehired? You want to be rehired? Huh? You want to be rehired? Say yes. Say yes, I'm telling you. I will count to three and you will say yes. One, two, three. Yes. Thank you, you're hired. <laughs> have, you, have you seen the Remedy Scientology TV series? No, I could give a shit what she thinks about Scientology. I already have my own opinion. Do you use NLP in your game? Yep. When's a new platinum mine coming out? Not yet. How many drinks y'all in? I had a lot when I was out. What are you drinking? Water. I'm trying to sober up so I can fucking talk to you guys. Mm-hmm. It's fucked up. What do you call a girl living in the Playboy Mansion of Czech Republic? Don't know. Fuck penis. Whoa. Mm-hmm. What do you believe will happen when we die? Don't care. What do you want it to be like when your next life? Don't care. I check me. Do you have a Mexican chica girlfriend? I have two. Make hey. his dick hard, not his life. Make mm. his pussy wet, not her eyes. Yep. We start in two minutes. Get ready. Cool. Oh, that feels good. Mm-hmm. Hello. Electra, are you awfully quiet? Let's hear you talking. Hey! Whoa. What are you doing? He just flew up two steps. Oh, no. <laughs> He's about to get checked. Oh, it's going to be true. Because what? He poops. He does that. He doesn't have to go to the bathroom. What he didn't pull outside, huh? No. He waited to come waited. inside to poop. That whole time. He waited to come inside to poop. Yeah. Shut it, you're so Look at these thoughts. Go away. How do you often fight Wait, in the gym? Oh. How often do you fight? Uh, I used to fight every day, but I don't anymore. <laughs> oh, I have chills. This is raunchy. I like that girl's hair. The one in the middle. Just the blonde and dark. Okay, cool. All right, we'll start soon. Arash, what's a good strategy to keep present in the moment? Don't know. These dogs tripping. One of my dogs is tripping. I'm from Israel. He oh, tripping, literally. The girl through the heart left is so hot. Arash, would you take a magic pill to make your hair grow back? Nope. Wow, it stinks. Ugh. Totally. Nope. It smells like roses and yeah. freaking... We fight pretty hard. And, 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 and freshness. Beautiful women. Yeah, ocean breeze. Yeah. And lilies. 250000 a year? I'm not going to pay that for a fucking video. I'm afraid people do it for free. Great beard. Yeah. Don't shave it. Okay, don't worry. You fight what type of fighting? Jiu-jitsu. My eyes are on fire from the flowers. It smells bad. No, the flowers are just blossoming yeah, in our garden right now. Yeah. And Shadow pooped oh downstairs. Ooh, it's another level. <laughs> I like how he ran hella hard after it. Yeah, he gets excited. He's, He's like, like yeah. freedom. <laughs> <laughs> Your opinion, best way to transfer sight into a unified loving humanity yeah. when everyone is able to flower into human potential. I don't think it's possible, brother. Has lady ever turned you down? Please tell the truth. Of course. Duh. No shit. Wait, a but, lady's turned you down? Yeah, but I don't give them that chance. Like, good evening, what's up, Evo? My game is not what you think. I don't hit on women, so I can't get turned down. But have I ever, That's like, approached I... and it wasn't right? Yeah, of course. I just back out. Someone who seemed can motivation, improve willingness. Okay. Looking forward to lecture. Right on. Sexy. Can a woman be satisfied with a good quickie? You teach how to fuck, last longer, how? Yeah, of course. Your Jessica is looking more and more beautiful by the day. I know that's my, my work on her. When you do it like shit, it becomes shit. Come. What? Nothing. You win some, you lose some. No, I don't even care. I don't even care. Mm. I don't think like you guys. Come. Trayvon says, come. I just came in my pants, Trayvon. You plan to get low? 
given nature of thought being limited to blah 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 what do you drink water how long blah blah or ask when you grow dated for six over and trust to get you to commit to monogamy do you just walk away with it there's no such thing as monogamy for me I don't deal with it come on Arash start the lecture not yet best way to tell if she wants your D looks at you touching you laughing all the above which girl of yours have fake hair none <laughs> big faces big places what the heck was that I don't know Okafina or filter tap? Aquafina. Ma Fuck Aquafina. Okafina. <laughs> Good evening. What's up, Ebo? Is it bad to sock myself in the head? Come on. The brunette chica had a nice smile. No. Her beard. Hello from Paris. What's up, Paris? We're about to start. We're just waiting for Hannah to finish what she's doing with no. the dogs. No. 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 Snap out of it, bro. Saw the brunette Move, smiling when you... Red fake hair. If you want to last longer, bed, have some practice. Hey, don't uh, just walk right in. Do what they do. What he does, he teaches you how to be awful. Walk right where you want. Sit your position. Been growing the beard for almost two years now. Would you remove all your tattoos if possible? No. Where are you guys from? San Jose. Freestyle lecture. Yep. Three sums would be amazing with your girls. Three sums. <laughs> have you seen Death Note? No, but I heard it was good. Tattoo. We start in one minute. Which tattoo hurt the most? Everybody asked me. I don't know. They all hurt. How many dogs do you have? I have four. Four pit bulls. They're all right here. One minute, ladies. You ready? Yeah. Totally. Good. Jessica, stop trying to show off your shit. It's too late. All right, so how fast do you bring up the fact that you have one many girlfriends that should be okay with it? I just, right away, they know I have girlfriends. I don't care. I don't think like you. I don't act like you. I'm not too keen about Death Note, okay? Does size matter? Yes. Ebo, unprivatized last couple of lectures, please. Mm -hmm. Bro, in LA full of angels, Rosh, ready boss, ready to go. Have you ever confused for a Mexican? No, what's your lecture today? Not sure. Dogs that would recognize smiling or crying? Don't know, what's up, bro? What's up? If you could be fire or water, earth, what would you be? I'd be water. Dollface versus Annabelle, who wins? No. What, what do you think? What do you think? My brand versus somebody else, what do you think? How long did it take you to turn alpha? Don't know. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me tuck my legs and start the lecture. It's Chris Brown with the breeze, okay? Money matter to women? Of course it does. Shout out from Ontario. What's up? All right, guys. I'll answer our question comments in a minute. I'm going to start my lecture. Move over, please. Move over. Move over. Move over. Thank you. Here we go. We start in 30 seconds. We're lost. Come on. Everybody, welcome to this very special lecture on Wednesday night. I'm Arash Zapar, motherfucking D. Bazaar. These are my beautiful girlfriends. The very beautiful Hannah, very luscious. <laughs> very beautiful Jessica, very funny and clever. Very beautiful Electra, very powerful and uh, penetrating. 
inappropriate. <laughs> Tonight, I come to you from having been out for the last three hours or so, interacting with the world and picking up on women. This is what I do. I'm very good at it. And I learn a lot when I'm out. Look for some videos and pictures coming out. Right, Maybe by tomorrow I'll put them up, okay? And um, let's talk. What's tonight's lecture on? Well, it's a surprise to me too. Mm -hmm. But let's talk about why, you, um, why people don't succeed as much as they should. And I'm going to give you one answer right now. There's many answers. The one that I'm going to tell you is pertains to what I just said earlier is that they don't know how to talk to each other people don't know how to talk to each other people don't know how to talk to each other okay they're very bad at talking to each other uh, Jessica was getting a piercing earlier today copying me because she likes to copy me <laughs> no. yes mm -hmm. and when we were at the piercing place um, at some point I looked at her and I said look at the way these people talk to each other they're such a mess yeah they're so nervous. Oh my gosh, that was so weird. <laughs> it's uncomfortable yeah. for me to listen to people. Yeah. Even watch them. Their totally. body language was like... Completely off, right? It's terrible. And when people don't know how to talk to each other, what happens is... Um, what happens is when you don't know how to interact with another human being, you then have... Um, no means of getting their cooperation or their trust. Let's talk about this. How do you trust somebody who doesn't know how to talk to you? Let's just start there, okay? Yeah. Let's talk about a person who doesn't know. Girls think about this. So about a person who doesn't know how to talk to you. Yeah. Like they're uncomfortable. They're weird. They're nervous. They're anxious. Yeah. They seem like they're unsure. Mm -hmm. and, and, then, and then they wonder why you don't trust them. Yeah, mm -hmm. totally. What do you think about that, Electra? I think that, you know, like... It almost like makes me suspicious of all of their communication that comes out. Because of course. I'm like, if you can't talk to me freely, right, and we can't have like this like fluid conversation, you yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. Then like, what are you thinking? Mm -hmm. Like, what the fuck is in your mind? Yeah, what's you going know? on in your head when you yeah, can't talk to me, right? Totally. Right? What do you think about that, Jessica? Personally, I either think that first. You're just like uncomfortable and weird. Mm -hmm. Second, you have anxiety and you're nervous. Like you have this like you don't know what to say kind of thing, which I get. Or um, you're dead. What does like, that mean? Like you are living, but you're not alive. You are just. Uh, well, how can you trust them is what I'm saying. The question is, how can you trust someone like that? Hell no. What about you, Hannah? What do you think about that? That can't like that has a hard time communicating. I mean, someone's trying to talk to you. They seem nervous. They seem unsure. They seem like they don't know what the fuck they're saying, right? And can you trust a person like that? Well, not immediately. No, it would take a lot of time because I mean, it just the way that communication can come across would be like suspicious, not trusting. Yeah. So let's talk about this, right? If you're saying that people don't seem to trust you, let's back it up a few steps, okay? Here's my question to you. How good are you talking to people? Totally. Right? Don't worry about it, Jessica. I'm here. Okay? I'm here. I'm don't Alpha Wolf. Enough. Don't worry about it. I got them. Nothing will happen with the dogs while I'm here. If it does, I'll fuck them up. How do you think people should trust you if you can't talk to them? Because you wouldn't trust people who can't talk to you well, right? So if you're walking around right now and you're going, man, I don't know why people don't trust me. I have a question for you. How good are you at talking to people? Let's start there, right? Totally. So I'm looking around today and I'm going, man, these people have a hard time, have, have a hard time talking to each other. Yeah. Really hard yeah. time talking to each other. And when they start, Oops. okay, so then, then let's, let's move forward, okay? Let's move forward. Then I go out tonight and I'm around some new people I haven't met before and then everybody starts talking and I start the conversation going and then the, the people are talking and I realize that nobody is listening to somebody else. Yeah. Oh, I hate that. She's saying oh, something. Yeah. She's saying something. She's And all they're doing is triggering in each other yeah. a thought for them to say. Totally. Yeah. Right? So, for example, this person says, I have a German Shepherd Boxer mix, and oh my God, my dog is so big. And this one right away says, I have a fucking Chihuahua or something, and I hate yeah. big dogs. Yeah. Then that one says, oh my God, I love dogs. 
and suddenly we have three people all simultaneously trying to talk about dogs, but nobody listening to anybody. Yeah, yeah. totally. So, so rude. It's crazy. Yeah. And so I'm sitting there watching going, wait, so like nobody heard the other person. And I could see that people were getting anxious. Totally. To just finish what they were saying, and every once in a while somebody would cut themselves off because somebody else would be more overbearing. Yeah. And then later they would try to come back in, and it would be so awkward. Right. Man. And I'm thinking, okay, so let's get this straight. First of all, everybody is uncomfortable, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Next, when they start to talk, they start to talk, they're all jumping on each other, and nobody's listening to each other. So yeah. now we're going to have two issues. One, people are uncomfortable talking to each other. So they don't trust each other. Two, when they do start talking and they actually say something, somebody else jumps on what they say about the same subject in regards to them. Totally. Right? Mm -hmm. They never really acknowledge what the fuck happens to the person that's talking. Yeah. Okay, come on. I thought I did it. Did I just read that right? A lot, right? Two? No. It was a lot. That's a lot. So now you have two issues. One, you think people don't trust you, but you don't know how to talk to them. Two, you think nobody understands you. Yeah, yeah. Nobody understands you. What's up? What's up? Hey, yo, listen. I got the, listen, I want y'all to know this right now. I got the biggest. Hey, you're live. You're live on YouTube. It's Benny Bates, everybody. YouTube right now. What? I got the biggest. Look, look, I'm, I'm going to let y'all know this right now. This is my mentor. This is like almost. My God, right here, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? Uh, he's used to these type of comments, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna let y'all niggas know. This is the nigga right here that is like that sets the trend for everything that I fucking do in life. I I follow every fucking video. I'm on YouTube right now, so I'm gonna let y'all motherfuckers know, you bitches. I'm hey, that's Benny Bates. He just dropped his new single. What's the single called? Drop my new motherfucking single, Chirping. Chirping. Let y'all know whoever's on fucking live. This is my nigga to the <laughs> And like, this is the motherfucker that sets the tone for everything that I do, bruh. The way that I act as far as like, when it comes to the females. I'm letting y'all know this. Because like, a lot of y'all niggas not even on the same type of level that I am on with the females. And he's on like 10,000 way females in just life. He's just 10,000 way more than me. But I learned from this guy. This dude right here is the greatest at what he does. He is the most motherfucking, like, comprehensive motherfucker of all motherfucking time. And this is a Raj motherfucking diva. <laughs> <laughs> and this is how I'm rocking. So, like, whenever I get to my platforms, whoever listening to this, if y'all are alive right now, y'all listen to this. Whoever listening to this, just know. I ain't no fuck nigga, I ain't no whack ass, I don't get no bitches type of nigga, I get shorties, I get love, I got multiple chicks, listen, I'ma just let you know, a raw Steve Bazaar is that motherfucking nigga, you dig? <laughs> he's not just that nigga, he's that motherfucking nigga, you dig? a raw motherfucking Steve Bazaar, follow the channel, follow the wave, Press subscribe, press whatever, like, uh, listen, I don't even know what more to explain to this motherfucker. This is that, nigga. <laughs> Thanks, brother. I'm going to lecture. That's, hey, Benny Bates, check out Chirpin, just dropped today. Go on YouTube, check out Benny Bates, you'll see who he is. Call you later, my brother. Thank you. Yo, listen, man. What? I'm going to lecture, man. Look, keep doing what you're doing. You already know. You're my, my mentor. I don't know. You're my nigga. I don't know. My chick's be looking, thinking like, yo, what? Like, yo, this nigga be following after this dude over the YouTube, and, like, he be got he got me under wraps. Like, crazy. Like, why he be following this dude? I be telling him, I be like, listen, I'm telling you, my nigga Arash motherfucking Divas, uh, mm -hmm. this is the nigga that I listen to get you, like, where you are right now. See what I'm saying? And, like, I don't got you under no spell. I don't got you under nothing. You know what I got you under? Real nigga shit. <laughs> Later, bro. Peace.
Thanks, man. Later. There you go. There you go. Yeah, wait, wait for that guy. Wait for that guy to be on the fucking Grammys. He's one of the best rappers I've, I've seen. He's on a whole other level. Benny Bass. Shout out to Benny. Okay. You have... You don't know how to talk to people. Mm-hmm. Next... When you do talk to them, no one's listening. Yeah. So that results in nobody gets me. Nobody understands me. Well, how can anybody understand you when they're also talking when you're talking at the same time? Yeah. Right? Now, we have to, we have to be realistic. Am I going to be out there tonight making great communicators out of the world? It's not going to happen. I'm not there trying to fucking lecture these brand new people they're sitting on my table and be like no, this is you have to acknowledge me now yeah. and now listen you got to listen to her like that's not going to happen so what are we going to do when we're surrounded by people who are just miscommunicating left and right and left and right and left and right what let me give do? you let me give you one one starting solution you girls ready yeah you two ready jessica yeah can you okay. see your phone real quick yeah you want to see my phone you know, you know, you know, you're in a good relationship, but you, get, you let your girl look at your phone. Okay, go ahead. I can't. I actually, I thought I could write, but I can't. <laughs> okay. Well, just blink a little bit, and see what happens. Okay. Yeah. Both eyes went blurry suddenly. <laughs> okay. You have any contacts? No, no. Yeah. Okay. Well, whatever. Relax. It's all good. Here's the first thing you have to do. You gotta get comfortable. Inside, you gotta get comfortable. Now that's easier said than done. Yeah. Right? Yeah. How do you become comfortable? Easy. Why don't you, you want to go look at your eye? Huh? Maybe go help her. All right, go over there. Her eye's fucked up. Okay. Okay. Help her. Go on her hand. Okay. The first thing you have to do. Dog. You got it. You got it. You got it. You got it. Dog. Dog tail. Hold her. Take her over there. Okay. The first thing you have to do is you have to make sure you become comfortable. If you're not comfortable, then other people around you are going to become uncomfortable. Do you get what I'm saying? So they feel, they feel your uncomfort. Why don't you go help her out, man? Go see what's going on. Yeah. Yeah. They feel your uncomfort. And so when I'm out, look, I look, I look kind of intense to people who don't know me, right? Normally I don't wear glasses, so I look even more rough than, than wearing glasses. Glasses calm me down a little bit. But when you're out there, <clears throat> when you're out there and you yourself become uncomfortable, you trigger in other people's uncomfort. So as I'm out sitting around and people coming up to me and they're trying to talk to me or I'm trying to talk to them, the first thing that I do is just be comfortable, right? If you're going to be, how are you be comfortable? One is you get rid of any internal, internal, doubtful dialogue. You stop, you stop trying, you stop trying to be cool. That's one of the hardest things to do, by the way. One of the hardest things to do is to not try to be cool, right? It, if you're trying to be cool, what happens is put pressure on you. It puts pressure on you. You're wondering how people are, are viewing you. And listen, we all go through it. I'm not sitting here saying like I have never experienced this, okay? What I'm telling you is this is the secret. The secret is the more comfortable that you get, the more comfortable other people get around you. It's that simple. And the more uncomfortable you get, the more un- uncomfortable they get. Do you get it? So if you ask yourself, like when I was going out tonight, I knew uh, I was going out with one of my friends. He called me up. He said, hey, hang out with these three chicks. And if you want to come by, blah, blah, blah. I said, cool. I realized as I was going over there, he tells me, he goes, look, one of these chicks, she took a picture with you. And her sister, her sister contacted her and was like, why are you hanging out with that guy? He brainwashes girls. Don't fuck him and weird shit like that, right? And I was like, wait, is she cool with me hanging around? Is she cool with me hanging out with you guys? Or is she like going to be weird about it? Because I don't want to hang out. I don't want to show up somewhere weird. I don't want to show up where people are going to be talking uncomfortably towards me. And he said, no, no, she's cool. Just her sister was giving her some kind of bullshit. And as I was driving up, and as I was getting out of the car, I, I caught myself being uncomfortable. I, I, I had a slight bit of 
nervousness inside me because I was about to walk up and I don't know what the fuck I'm walking into. These people know each other. I don't know them. And I'm about to walk up and they're going to fucking say some shit to me. And you know what I did? The whole time, I just made myself more and more comfortable. I just made myself more and more in tune and more relaxed and less worried about what people think. And I thought to myself, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go over there. Listen to this. very important. I'm going to keep to myself. I'm going to sit down. And I'm going to feel out the situation. I'm not going to try to push myself on people. I'm going to hear whatever people are talking about. I'm going to see if what they say is related to... Just what am I saying? Listen, I'm not pushing myself on people. I'm going to go over there. I'm going to be comfortable. I'm going to see what's going on. And I'm going to be there. So I fucking show up. I sit down. The girls aren't there. My dude's there, my friend. We're hanging out. I'm like, hey, what's the story with this chick? He's like, yeah, her sister, her sister was talking shit about you, blah, blah. I'm like, God damn it, whatever. So I got some other girl. I'm calling her up. She's going to meet us. And I'm like, cool. Well, if they're going to act stupid, then somebody else is here. We're going to hang out with her. Then I'm like, oh, they're coming. I could see them. I see them walking across the street. So I started getting uncomfortable. I'm like, I'll keep it cool. They come. I say, hello, how are you doing? And they sit down. I keep to myself. I keep to myself. You guys want drinks, he says, this and that. They get drinks. I sit down. Two girls go. And the girl whose sister was uncomfortable with me, she goes, I'll wait here. And I was surprised because it was going to be her and I sitting together while everybody left. And I didn't understand that. She insisted three times. I'll just wait. You guys get the drink. No, I'll wait. We'll get the drink. I was like, okay, shit. Now, I didn't want to sit there and be in total silence. I didn't want to sit there and try. No. I didn't want to sit there and try to act like I'm going to make conversation. So I'm just, let's see what happens. They go, I wait, I wait, like a few beats, and then I'm like, how was your day today? And she's like, oh, day was good, blah, 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 starts the conversation. Next thing you know, her and I are in this really nice, comfortable conversation, engaged conversation, naturally flowing, that's what you want, naturally flowing, good, good, good. Other people come out, they all sit down, they see you're having a good conversation. Little by little, as time goes forward, they start telling me, by the way, you know, so-and-so said this negative thing about you, and I don't really believe that, and somebody else said this about you, and I was like, damn, that's so good. Why? One, you got to be comfortable. You got to be comfortable. This is the secret. This is what I'm teaching you. You got to be comfortable. Now, that's like, how comfortable can you be? It's just a scale of getting more and more comfortable. That's, that's the practice. Be more and more comfortable with life. Number two. Number two, let people talk and listen to them. Then when it's the right time to speak, speak. A lot of times you have these social anxieties because you think you have to say something. I'm telling you, take it from a person who knows how to communicate. Sometimes you just have to listen. It's okay. It's okay to hold back. It's okay to listen. It's okay to ask questions. It's okay to be interested in other people. That's the secret of communication. That's the secret of good business. Secret of sales. Secret of money, wealth, women. How do you think I get women? You get what I'm saying? Hold on. <laughs> okay, all kinds of shit on Instagram right now. So. Let's work on these two basic rules in your communication when you go out there. So you're more influential and you get people listening to you better. They like you better. Wait, are you okay or are you not okay yet? No, it's okay. No, you're, don't come if you're not okay. okay you're spiritually, but not no, then you guys got to handle that. That's not okay. You can't be like that. If you got to, if you got a doctor, you got to go to the doctor. That's weird. Yeah, really. Right? That's not okay. Well, the pain came, and then that came, and then the pain hasn't gone away. So I think when the pain goes away, that will go away. Hannah, what do you think? You're the medical doctor. You're the medical yeah, officer. I don't see how. I understand that, but it can't. It can't be that. I mean, that sounds like something is wrong. You know what I mean? We can't yeah, be like that. I mean, her vision. According to that. Well, you can't be in the lecture right now because I'm lecturing. And I'm going to be distracted. Okay? I need you to be taken care of. So if you guys want to go upstairs, well, why don't you go upstairs, maybe rest, put some cold compress, give it like 30 minutes. If you got to go to the doctor, you got to the doctor, baby. That's just what it is. I'm not fucking with that. I'm, I'm, I'm being straight up. Huh? Go, 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 go take care of each other. Okay? Go take care of each other. Go. Okay? I'm going to finish my lecture up.
No, watch out, dogs. Okay, so remember that people are going to feed off of your comfort and uncomfort. Now, here's what's interesting. I got four pit bulls right here, right? They also understand these rules. Number one, if you're not comfortable... If you're not comfortable, hey, move, man. Hey, move. Got to stop the dogs. They're going to fight. You know what I mean? If you're not comfortable around these animals, they're going to feel it. They're going to feel your tension, and your tension is going to feed their tension. Next thing you know, you have an issue. That's how I can tell if they're about to get in a fight with my dogs, right? I watch their body language. I see how they stand around each other. I see if someone's stiff, someone's loose. <clears throat> that determines so when you see me control them hey hey move this i'm doing this because they're getting tense it's not having a stroke she's okay so remember your comfort your relaxation is a big deal number two you pay attention to what people say and get if you want to get rid of your social anxiety a big part of it right don't worry so much about, I have to say something. I have to be liked. I have to be somebody. All that is extra, extra pressure. The girls went up because Jessica's fucking eyes started hurting. So I, you can't have that, you know? So, help her out if not go to the hospital, I said. Okay? Start hurting her eyes, fucking hurting. So, um, don't put the extra pressure on yourself. What's happening is, you internally are putting so much pressure on yourself that you have to be a certain way, you have to act a certain way, you have to be liked a certain way. And so what that does, that extra pressure on you results in a foolish level of communication or results in, um, um, it results in a um, wrong, wrong interaction with the world. One second. Hannah! Hannah, come down. Okay. Grab two aspirin for her, please. Okay. Be quick. Is she getting better? Okay, do, go quick. Give her two aspirin in the middle of it. Okay, a lot of the a lot of the social issues that you have is that you are putting undue pressure on yourself. Now imagine, right? Imagine I am doing this lecture right now, and I start putting all this weird pressure on myself, right? Um, I gotta do this. I gotta do that. I gotta. They gotta like me. Blah 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 blah. I can't. I gotta just do what I gotta do. I gotta feel as my communication comes up. I have to pay attention to my environment, deal with it as it happens, and continue my lecture as necessary. You see, the basics of life are really simple. Be genuine, be sincere in your communication, and be respectful. I think if you keep these three things in mind, you're gonna go very, very far, because where people have fucked up with you is think about it. They haven't been genuine, they haven't been sincere, and they have not been dis they have not been respectful, right? No, Shadow, come on, man. I'm trying to drink water. God damn it. All right? Be genuine. That like genuinely, how do you feel? Speak from the fucking heart. Right? Speak from the fucking heart. Be genuine. Then be sincere. Like mean what you say. Don't say shit you don't mean. You know, people sometimes ask me, they're like, oh, do you compliment women? I'm like, sure, I compliment women. I love women. And they're like, how do you compliment them? Sincerely. Sincerely. Like I'm not going to compliment a girl on something that is not complimentable. <laughs> right? You find something that is... Something you could actually compliment, something you admire, something you like. And then you do it in a non-sexual way. So you have genuine communication, sincere communication, 
and and in the end respectful communication if you keep in mind that when you're in a social situation you don't want to disrespect people anybody who becomes disrespectful in a social situation is actually violating everybody it's violating everybody in the environment you get what I'm saying so keep in mind that if these three things you have going on for you and then you add to it one simple thing be very relaxed as relaxed as you could be like my uh, my mentor Manu you know passed away like 17 years ago that was his big thing he was like you have to be very very relaxed what is my phone he said you have to be very relaxed don't get out there on the stage Don't get out there on the stage with tension. Tension is the enemy of the artist, Manu would say. So the more tension you have in your communication, the more tension you have in your life, the more problems you're going to have, okay? The goal is to be relaxed, is to be genuine, is to be sincere and respectful. I swear to God, if you teach your children this shit and you practice with them, you practice by yourself, relaxing, genuine, sincere, and just be respectful, as respectful as you can be, even when people around you are being disrespectful. Do your best to keep your respect. Then you got it, okay? Now, I got to get up there and check on my girls soon. So uh, I'll take some of your questions and comments now. Keep it kind of a short lecture. Go ahead. I'll answer your questions and comments now, guys. Tension is enemy artist. That tense feels like gonna stick to me. Yes, for Mono, you're not relaxed tonight because the other girls, because of the girls are hurt. Well, I'm as relaxed as I can be. I'm not very tense. I'm I'm thinking about them, you know. So the end vocal tonality projection internal relaxation. It's part of it. Arash, I want multiple girlfriends long term, but also want to have kids. Do you have a solution for this? Yes, I can do it. So if you need to learn what I know. Arash is super caring. Yo, of course I am, dude. Of course I am. There would never be any women with me. There would be no women with me if I didn't care. You think women are that stupid? Okay, so I'm shy quick and I learned to get over this. Any any help? Yeah, get on Diamond Mind program. Okay, my diamond. How can you relax if your body is tense? You relax your body first. Weak father or no father? God, you had a good one. I had a good one. Short but sweet lecture. Yes, thank you. Yeah, I had a great father. I still do. Out of water, so I gotta suck the ice. But actually allows you to slow down and think. Much love and thanks for teaching. Yeah, respect. But your programs go into the kids thing. Diamond mind is the basics of thinking the way I do. You need that. Without it, you don't know enough. Then everything else. See, you're always looking for that one answer. You gotta know everything I know. Check that girl, man. Dude, I got fucking three girls up there helping her, okay? Thank you, Arash, very useful. Why do you do this? Why do you do diamond? Because I want to. Awesome, bro. Thank you, my brother. You're welcome. There's Shide music. Check out Shide, everybody. Check out Shide on, on YouTube. Sick, sick rapper. The only people who talk shit about Arash are those who don't know him. Don't just bug his cover. No, they know me. That's why they talk shit, because they don't want people to like me. It's okay. They don't get anywhere. I keep getting better. Thanks, boss. Good night. OB says, boys, and no. Hey! Then find a mentor if you had a weak father. Did Richard De La Rana program crash and burn? I don't know what that is. How do you defend yourself while respecting the social setting? I show you every day. Watch how I live. Get on my socials. Get on my social media. I try to put my, as much as I can live, man. I try to show you guys how to live. I try to show you what I do in this society. You know, in a society of sheep, I try to show you how to live. How they're, you're unstoppable. You just keep going. Good lecture tonight, brother. Hope Jessica's okay. Sending love. She'll be fine. Any happy techniques to give? No, just look up NLP, man. Arash, I completely agree with the rapper you have your honor. You're the man. You make people greater. Yes, thank you, Vernon. What is the purpose of life? You make your own answer for that. Cool thoughts, brother. Thanks. Many people aren't happy because their inability to control the situation in their terms. Yep. The villain. You're a wise old man. What spiritual practice do you use? Any alchemy. All of them, actually. All alchemy. Is believing in yourself just start... Or the end goal. There's no such thing as start and end goal. Greatness is always a rush. Be the best fucker. Guys. This is Dee Dee. What's the most women you've had at the same time? I can't count. It's been too many to count. 
Why do people self-sabotage? No idea. Diamond Mind is the best thing I've ever invested in. Thank you, Alejandro. I love how you say bullies never bully those who fight back. Laugh about how to give people love and hate fuck fold. Yep. What do you drive? I, I drive a Maserati, but I also have a Jeep and I have a few other cars. How to fight with the different failures of life if you fail again and again and again. Get on Diamond Mind. It'll be a problem. It won't be a problem. Is it ever cool to be beta? Don't know. Be a lie in a sheep society. I am. Catherine, just go. We better be okay. Your home is filled with enough love to heal anything. Thanks for your wisdom. Good night to you and the ladies. Good night, Catherine. You're taking care of it right now. Twerking videos here. Is there billions in some kinds of weaknesses? I don't know. I don't deal with that. Hope one of your girls gets better. Of course, they'll get better. New Orleans was a programming reel. Yep. Salam. Please let this lecture up. Okay? It's evil. will do it. I want to see it again. Cool. Share it, you know. Can't wait for the car adventure. <laughs> it's good. Do you ever speak about spirits as a part? Sometimes. Do you put... Do you put some profit from your business back into it? For example, using all a lot of it. What animals do you love the most? I love dogs. Maybe for my good for hangovers, do you respect? Don't know. How do you deal with clingy girls? I want too much every time. I'm okay with them. You go and consider becoming an Uber driver. You can really pick up artists. Get it? <laughs> Not an Uber driver, dude. That was a funny joke. Have you studied Vedanta? No. I have not. If you had a zillion dollars, what would excite you to wake up? Same shit excites me today, bro. So you believe in ghosts? Yes, not believe, but I know. What's the obvious position? What's the best book to improve your touch with women? I don't know about the book for that, but my programs are. Have you ever experienced any kind of genre somebody state? Yes, respect. Yeah, report. Yes, but is she, is, how's, how's her? Okay, you gotta go to the doctor. Okay. Just you and your success. Okay, everybody. I'm going to wrap this up. Thank you for being on. Okay. As Manu Tupo said to me, be the best and fuck the rest. Remember, loyalty is royalty. We are IMC Nation. I'll see you. Thanks for attending, everybody.